Oh, and now we've got shoulders, high reps, lowish weight. Into week five. Into, into week five. So this is going to be a uh, this is going to be a push. So what's going on, guys? Sam Adam here, CA Fitness TV. We are in the gym, shoulders day, and this one's going to be a slog. But I'm hoping <laughs> to get through this as quickly as possible, pushing through um, and end the week on a high. I think the reason why I'm feeling a little bit tired and stuff like that is just because I was in the gym yesterday evening. Usually I'd get about 24 hours rest before I come back into the gym, but we're back in first thing this morning. So it's just 12 hours? Isn't 12 it? hours, yeah. Body kind of, uh, um, my body trying to regenerate and stuff, which is difficult. So let's get into it. I'm only three reps, uh, three uh, sets in. And first exercise. Your first exercise, yeah. Uh, Just the fatigue builder. It is. It's a. Uh, I know I'm kind of kicking to gear shortly. It's just, um, yeah. It's just kind of getting your body back into doing so many reps. I got so used to, you know, drop rep, drop rep, drop, uh, drop rep, and then now I've gone back to increase reps. It's just. Uh, a little bit more tire tiring, but I think as I pull into the workout, and also I'm trying to I'm trying to operate at a, a relatively quick pace today. Uh, and just re reason being more so stuff to do, so can't spend all day in the gym. I'm not I'm not that privileged, unfortunately. So I just need to get through it really quickly and then uh, keep it moving. So I'm gonna get set four now and then move on to the next exercise. <laughs> you didn't like that, did you? Uh, four sets, 12 to 15 reps. Bent over, rear delt, flies with the twist. Done. Let's move on to uh, side cable, lat raises. Oh, you can get them as well, the three. Are they finished on it or is he coming on to it? Uh, Looks like. I think I saw him setting something up, but oh. it might be good, so let's move over. I don't know whether to go with the same weight as what I did in week one because. Or just one plate there? Yeah, I can go one plate Four sets, 12 to 15 again. Let's go. Hot in here. It's hotter again. Ooh. That's why you're getting water. You know the stipulation yeah. for yeah, water. Yeah, that's true. They, they give with one hand and take with another. <laughs> oh. Free setting. I am really feeling it with the increased uh, increased rep range. It is hard work, but we're getting there, we're getting through it. We're going to hit set four now. Keep it moving. We're working also at a pretty quick pace. So, uh, so that's taking its toll as well, but let's get on to set four, finish strong. Four sets did 12 reps. Uh, I'm working up a sweat now. We're gonna get onto the bonus exercise now, which was the um, sort of the heavy, heavy lap pulls. 
four sets to get ten reps. That ten reps. Or was it? Was it going twelve to fifteen? Yeah. Did I try? Did I try? Did I try and cut some reps off? Yeah. Shame, shame on me. Twelve to fifteen reps. Um, I think I started off with eighty. Was it? Late. I don't remember. Yeah. I'll start off with 80. If it's too light, I'll go heavier, but I don't think it will. That's all I can say about that. It's brutal. Oh. I'm getting through quicker than I did the previous exercise. Probably because the range of motion is shorter. But with the increased weight, you feel it that little bit more. So, I've got one more set to go. I'm going to end strong now. Um, but boy, we've got, we've got uh, Smith Machine next. That's going to kill you. That is going to kill me. Let's get set four out of the way, then, <laughs> then we'll start thinking about uh, the next exercise. Set four. Next exercise, Smith Machine. The one you're dreading? Yeah, I am to, I am to some degree. Just because week one, it was at this point where things you know, went a little bit haywire and uh, didn't, didn't select the weight right and all of this sort of stuff. So, if we come back, um, starting with 20 kg aside, um, and the reason why I've gone with 20 kg aside um, is because when, in week one, I probably should have done 15, I did 20, and it kind of messed up the whole flow. So, I'm going to start with 20. Um, I think hopefully the weight should be right. Uh, four sets, 12 to 15. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna go, just get after it, see see what we can do. Um, hopefully, I'm say being physically stronger now, it should be easier. My only um, sort of doubt, which I'm trying to kind of eradicate from my mind right now, is the, is the sort of quick turnaround in terms of coming back into the gym. But hopefully, that shouldn't matter. So, without further ado, shoulder press, Smith machine style. Even still, I got to about eight reps, started to feel the pinch, but I knew I was strong enough to push through for 12. Um, yeah, not bad. I'm happy, especially, with it, especially this time around, I feel comfortable at the weight. Whereas last time, as we all saw with footage, I got the weight wrong, which in turn compounded the whole workout. Was it wrong uh, on shoulders? I yeah. It was just... No, no, it was shoulders. So week one, I did, I put, 20 kg aside, and so I split reps, and I split reps, split reps, and it, it was a, uh, yeah, it kind of soured the workout. But this time round, I think because I'm physically stronger, um, I'm taking to this weight a lot easier, so I should be able to transition through um, all the weeks now, you know, kind of knowing where I need to be in that sort of So, really happy with this. With this, I, can't, I was dreading it from the last uh, from the last exercise, but I come over here, we're doing the right things. Got my breathing right. Got all of those uh, little tips and tricks that we highlighted. And things are going well. So I'm gonna grip my teeth, get through set four, and let the show continue. You saw the struggle in that one. But again, um, four weeks ago, I would have quit on that. I'd have quit rack the weight, um, and probably split rep it, all sorts of stuff just to kind of get through. Now I'm feeling so much stronger that I'm able to just push myself straight through the 12 reps. So I did four sets of 12. If you did four sets of 15, my G. <laughs> if you did 12, you know, 
we've got the rep range, that's all it's about. So I'm happy with that. We're gonna move on to the next exercise, which I think is, was it the bonus exercise? The uh, front plate lifts with the, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, and, then, and then to the pet yeah. deck and then, cool. So bonus exercise next, catch you there. Three down, but I enjoy this super set, so I don't mind it too much. Three down, one more to go. Two sets of ten. Uh, feeling good, feeling really good now. We're into the final stretch of the of the back workout, so let's uh, let's keep it strong. On a, on, a, on a on another subject, many of you guys don't know I'm a boxing fan. I love my boxing. I, I like my MMA, but I prefer my boxing. So obviously we've got the grand fight, Mayweather, Conor McGregor. We all know what's going to happen there. <laughs> and uh, and uh, Glitchko retiring this week, which is a shame. Uh, you know, but to be honest, after he lost to Anthony Joshua in a fight he should have won, yeah. um, I think the Ryan was on the wall. So it's a shame because I'd have liked to have seen him in a farewell fight, you know, go out on a high in Germany, win. But well, he decided to announce his retirement, so you know what? Bravo to that guy. Uh, but as I always say in here, the show must go on, and we got some fights to look forward to. Start with May uh, Mayweather McGregor, and we all know that the money team's coming victorious. You know what I mean? So tune in August 26. I don't know why I'm plugging the fight for them, <laughs> but I'm plugging it nonetheless. I'm Team Mayweather all day, every day. Set here, I felt that one. I felt it on set one. Feeling it a little bit. I'm feeling it more in my tri my triceps as well, as I'm taking the weight back. Uh, but also as well, it's just because it's under load for longer um, versus doing five reps or you know six to eight reps or whatever. It's just under load a lot. Um, but we've got one set left. Uh, get that one done. Get on to the final exercise. And then, as always, push ourselves through the step max there, master. So. Standing, side, lap, raises. <laughs> I don't know why I'm terrible at like remembering and reciting what the names of exercises are. Uh, I just remember the motions, that's, that's what it is. Anyway, fourth set, I'm going to try and plug through this quickly. I'm kind of on just above time of how long I wanted to be in the gym today. So I'm gonna work through these four, four sets quick, 12 to 15, but we're looking for 15 reps because it's the final exercise. Let's finish strong, end week five on a high. That wasn't too bad. 
Even though I'm out of breath, it wasn't actually too bad. <laughs> Not like yesterday, anyway. Well, yesterday was a little bit harder. Today it was alright. So that brings an end to another good week. It's been a, been a really, really good, consistent week. Um, made some gains. Made some. Uh, set some new kind of like foundations. Um, so looking forward to the step up again into week two. I'm really tired. I'm gonna get out of here real quick. Try and get something to eat. Recharge the body. So uh, keep this one short and sweet. I'll catch you guys again next week. As always, stay focused, stay motivated, stay disciplined, stay in the moment in your training sessions. Um, catch us on social media. Uh, I was going to say hashtag <laughs> Instagram, Facebook, uh, Twitter, and Snapchat. Hashtag SCA Journey, hashtag SCA Fitness TV. Uh, if you're new, subscribe. Comment, share, like. Uh, SCA Fitness TV all day. Catch you next week. Peace.